Hello everyone, welcome. In this series of videos we are working on labs that are available on the GitHub for AZ-104 Microsoft Azure Administrator Examination. In this video we are going to start lab 03A Manage Azure Resources by using the Azure portal. There are three different objectives, task 1, 2 and 3. We're going to do the task 1 in this video, which is create resource groups and deploy resources to resource group. Okay, so let's get to it. Um, so we'll log into the Azure portal, search for the resource group, and we're going to create this particular resource group. So I'm here in my Azure portal. So you can search for the resource group. That's what I do for most. Uh, search and find type activities so these are all the existing resource group that I have I'm gonna create a new resource group so I'll click add and uh, what they're saying this is gonna be the name of the resource group so select the subscription what do you have uh, for the resource group this is the name that they're saying region any region uh, that's available so East US is fine so here review and create and click create review and create and then validation pass so you can create it should uh, create this resource group which is already done it says resource group created and we can go to the resource group in the azure portal um, search for and select disk and click add so once this is done uh, what is saying uh, select the disk and select the disk once the disk is there you can click the add button again so we're trying to add a managed disk uh, again the resource group is the group that uh, we have created in the previous step we're going to choose that one so here resource group let's choose the rg1 that we created in the previous step and the name of the disk we're going to give it this uh, and uh, region any region availability zone none source type none so they're all good uh, note when creating resource you have the option or of creating a new resource group or using a new resource group so we know that already if we wanted we we could have created a new resource group for this one all right next uh, uh, that's pretty much it so that's all about how to create a resource group and how to deploy a new resource within a resource group so now we have submitted and the deployment is is in progress and it will be deployed in just a minute the other way to do it which is not in the lab is you can also go to the resource group and go to the resource group itself the deployment is done by the way and from here you can also click on the add button and you can search for disk and you click on it and you can click on the create button from here as well and that will automatically pick up uh, create your resource within this resource group so it's only asking disk to test I can do something like that test disk to test and uh, your source blob you're asking for some something that I have not uh, defined uh, this is the classic one I don't want the classic one I want I want the regular one sorry disk uh, disk manage disk create so it's everything is pre-filled so you can also deploy your resources from within a resource group that's I, that's all I wanted to show so uh, we are done with the first section of the lab so that's the end of this lab and in the next lab we're gonna see how to move resources between resource group so see you thank you for watching this video I hope you like it please give me a thumbs up and uh, like it subscribe it and share it with your friends good luck with the exam